Today, what I would like to do is to help you understand the key moments of this forum as we launch it today, so that you have a sense of what we are bringing to Kigali this year. We continue to grow the forum from the 500 people when we started a while ago to now 5,000 people again here in Kigali. We had to stop registration. So we continue to appreciate the intensity and the support with which the government of Rwanda brings to this forum. The theme of this forum, innovate, accelerate and scale, delivering food systems, transformation in a digital and climate era in Kigali, a city of history, culture, exceptional hospitality and innovation. We all agree that food systems transformation remains a major concern for Africa today and into the foreseeable future. Firstly, because food demand on the continent is currently growing at an average rate of 3% per annum. And secondly, the continent's population that's growing at the same rate will nearly double from the current state to around estimated 2.4 billion by 2050. It is also concerning that the state of food security in the continent is worsening with over 20% of the continent's population un undernourished. The food import, import bill is still very high, beyond 60 billion a year. We should take the responsibility for what is happening to our food systems. We are spending about only 4.6% of its total public spending on agriculture, falling short of the 10% target of the 2014 Malabu Declaration on Accelerated Agricultural Growth and Transformation for Shared Prosperity and Improved Livelihoods. Excellencies, food systems are local but also global, linking through trade and sophisticated financial markets. These markets rely on transactions and information that influence the decisions farmers make about inputs, including land, labor, and technology. I commend the choice of this year's theme, Innovate, Accelerate, and Scale, delivering food system transformation in the digital and the climate era. This theme reminds us of our shared vision to scale up our efforts to transform our food systems. This year's forum is particularly significant as it precedes critical milestones for our continent. As you are aware, next year, 2025, the African Union's Malabo Declaration will elapse. We also have less than six years to achieve the sustainable development goals. As, uh, as we work to fulfill our commitment, we find ourselves facing a deeply concerning situation. The food is a fundamental human right, yet across our continent. Thank you very much. So I these form 85% of the African private sector. So our report is mainly about the fast. 
It was 145 million people in 1990. It's a half a billion people today. So let's think about who is this private sector that's supplying this vast river for risks. Your sourcing and marketing initiatives all depend. Uh, but, in, uh, but as that's being done, I'd like to introduce them if they can. Who's also one of the authors of that, of that report, 